Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another capsule series. Today's selection that I would love to showcase for you is another of the blend series. This is the blend series volume two. And what we're gonna show is the business, leisure, evening elegance, nightlife, and daily fragrances that are gonna be great recommendations for you guys to go out in this ending of winter, beginning of spring season. If this sounds like the type of content you think you'll enjoy, pull up a seat, pour a glass, and let's enhance. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to The Dry Down. This is the channel where we aspire to enhance and elevate our olfactive sensory experiences through the understanding of the different aromas, faucets, and nuances of scent cigars and wines. I'm your host, Chris. Welcome to today's experience. As I stated today, we're gonna to get into another blend series, Blend Volume 2, and I'd first like to start out with my favorite of all the business fragrances that I own, and this is the fragrance Spice and Wood by Creed. This is a fragrance perfumed by Olivier Creed. This is one of the best synergistic fragrances that includes spices and woods, powerful, poignant, sensual, sensationally made, a fragrance that is done with cedar wood, Angelica, which is the main player in this particular fragrance that brings the synergy together of this fragrance. It has great, great sense and presence about it that brings about a duality of those powdery, powdery woods and spices, along with the powerful woods and spices that you will love in any fragrance that brings you forth as a commanding presence in a business setting. Once again, this is one of the best, most, it, this fragrance is a fragrance that absorbs your surrounding. It brings in everyone close to you, makes you more of an inviting presence, and also gives you a sense of power and elegance in a sophistication type of setting. So when you're going out and you're doing your daily business and you want to have a scent on that is built around a powerful, inviting mode or mood, this is the particular fragrance I choose to go to, which is Spice and Wood, perfumed by Olivier Creed. Great up top, it has the all uh, bergamot from Creed. It has their musk, it has a tad bit of their orris. It has a great cedar, allspice, and nutmeg spice accord that stays into this and brings it its projection it gives it its sillage and that along with the encompassing um, clove note makes this one of the most sensual fragrances as a business fragrance so you can go into any business meeting and seduce everyone inside the room and they will become people under your command this is creed's spice and wood done by olivia creed great fragrance Next up for the Leisure scent, this is a great scent that I have rarely heard much about. This is a scent that is done by world-renowned perfumer and Dior um, perfume king. This is done by Francois de Marche. And this is a scent done for Aqua de Parma Colonia. And what he did is he went out and found one of the most beautiful sandalwood accords and lavender and laid it over that really nice warm citrus accords that aqua de Porma is known for if you like scents that have a great presence of provincial lavender which is a sweet almost honey hay lavender and a extraordinary sandalwood accord you will love this barbershop fragrance no doubt this is one that you can take and have so many moments with and it has such an alluring effect to it from anyone that smells it on you it can be one that you can take into a sporting situation and or it's even fresh enough to take into a gym setting so if you're working out this is a great fragrance for you this is the all day wear fragrance that'll go especially with the dry down being a bit musky and sweet from tonka bean and that prolonging lavender that they use the also the opening is so inviting with their concoction of bergamot bitter orange the pedigree that they love inside of their fragrances you can't go wrong as a leisure scent when you put on sandola now, I will do this disclaimer. This scent is not for everyone, but if you are a person that loves the provincial or provincial style of lavender, you will fall in love with this scent. It's creamy, it's inviting, it's leisure, 
It's playful. It's fun to wear. And it's a great scent overall. Like I said, done by Francois Dumaché. You know it's a great blend. It has great performance, longevity, and presence about it with a nice sillage to it. That is Aqua de Palmer's Sandolo for the leisure scent in today's blend volume two. Next up, ladies and gentlemen, the evening elegance fragrance for today's blend is one of the most beautiful, complex fragrances that you will ever put your nose on. This is Roja Parfums Diaghilev. This is a floral sheepra, a masculine floral sheepra that is one of the most, as I stated, complex and complete blends that you will ever put your nose on. This fragrance has, as a main player for me, it has the most sensuous ylang ylang and oak moss combination over a subtle jasmine and patchouli along with a completely arousing violet and tuberose, black currant, and then a beautiful, beautiful base of sweet cedar wood, sister's labdomum, and benzoin. Those are just a few of the fragrance notes in this particular scent that makes it one of the most elegant evening fragrances that you can put on your skin. I, for one, I, this is a scent that Roja Dove set out to complete a task of showing the world of what a critic, artist, and almost an, the, the person that he wanted this fragrance to com, be concurrent with and running adjacent to as a personality type is a man that is about town, that is about luxury, that is about opulence, that is about filling space and making that space his own. That is what this fragrance does. This is one of the most gorgeous wearing 24 hour scents that you can ever put your nose on. For me, Diaghilev is a fragrance that takes the epitome of what perfumery is and puts it in a bottle. Anyone who wants to have an elegant evening fragrance should get their nose on at least a sample of or try to get themselves the 7.5 milliliter option to purchase Diaghilev. This is a scent if you have a young nose or an unexperienced nose, it will be one that is slightly off-putting, especially for men. You'll be taken in and drawn in by the scent, but you can't be comprehending that you may not be the one for this fragrance. But trust me, men, if you put this on your skin, this is one of the most gorgeous wearing fragrances that you could put on your skin, especially for evening and elegant nights out on the town, living your life to the fullest. Luxury, opulent, sensual, sexual, and like I said, a 24-hour fragrance with two sprays. You will purchase this bottle and have it for the rest of your life. I've had this for five years and look at it. No doubt, one of the most premium, exquisite, and elegant fragrances you could put in your life. This is Diaghilev by the House of Roja Parfums, done by Roja Dove himself. Beautiful fragrance. Next up, ladies and gentlemen, I have for you as the nightlife fragrance, the Parisian Prince, the king of seduction himself, Mason Francis Kirk John, has produced Grand Soir for us ladies and gentlemen to partake on one of the most beautiful scents uh, produced. This amber-based fragrance that goes around a beautiful cord of vanilla. And if you're a vanilla fan and you've never got your nose on this, I don't know what you're waiting for. This is, to me, one of the best vanillic benzoin fragrances that you can find on the market today. It has a very simple note breakdown, but it's so beautifully made. It's so for the nightlife that you can't get enough. This is an alluring scent that if you're on a date, your date won't be able to keep their hands off you. Tonka bean, vanilla, uh, benzoin, and sister's labdanum are the accords and notes that he placed into this fragrance. And you know how Mason Francis Kirk John can blend the fragrance. This is a eight hour fragrance from start to finish. It has great projection, but the thing about this particular fragrance is the sillage. If you're on a date and you have somewhat of a, a, a passerby or a nice whiff of wind or air that comes across and someone picks up your scent, it is a head turner. Sexy, sensual, well-developed, great for evenings, nights out, and the nightlife. Gentlemen, if you wear this out to the clubs, anyone who smells this scent on you, that is of the opposite sex will become enthralled with your scent trail. Sometimes they will follow and sometimes they will tap and sometimes they will ask, what is it that you're wearing? And trust me, this is a conversation starter. 
So have your game tight if you're wearing this because someone will say, sweetheart, can I ask you a question? What is that you're wearing? And you be ready to tell them the scent that I want to leave on your bed. That's all I got to say. Again, that is Grand Soir by Mason Francis Kirkjohn for the Nightlife Fragrance. And for all of my gentlemen who love to go out into the daily basis and smell of an upscale presence, smell of a, um, a complete and powerful presence, I present to you a scent that is done, and I bet many of you didn't know this, this scent was done under the head and tutelage of Roja Dove. So if you are a person out and about looking for what Roja Dove can do and you feel like you can't afford it or don't want to spend that pretty penny, I get that. I don't blame you for it at all. But if you want to and you feel the desire to see a complex and complete, just beautiful fragrance, get your nose on Fougere Royale by Hubagon. This fragrance is built around rose centifolia, one of the best roses you can find geranium, lavender, carnation, oak moss, patchouli. What else we have in here? We got cinnamon, a great cinnamon spice in this particular fragrance. Amber is in the base of this fragrance. Bergamot is in the opening of this fragrance. You also have a chamomile, which is one of the best chamomiles that you will find in a fragrance. This is such a energizing fragrance for anyone to wear on a daily basis. This is a fragrance that you can go through three bottles of. It is a mature scent, so I wouldn't suggest to anyone 25 and younger that is in my audience to wear this. Not because I don't think that you have the aura about you to wear it, but it just sends off a completely different uh, message if you're young and you're wearing this. It won't send off the message correctly that you're trying to convey. There are other scents that I will introduce to you guys to wear in that particular situation at your age. But my men, that you are 25 and up as a daily scent, this herbaceous floral green fougere fragrance is a beautiful scent that Roja Dove has put his thumb on and has about 10 to 15 accords in it and each one comes out in a perfect perfect blending matter you can't not pick out the fragrance notes but you can't decipher them as well it's one of those fragrances that you will smell every single note inside of it throughout the wearing of about 10 hours Put about six to seven sprays under your shirt, get the wafts of it, and everyone around you will think and know that you are the person that smells that great on a daily basis. Once again, this is Fougere Ruel or Royale by the House of Hubigat, done under the tutelage with Roja Dove himself. So if you want a Roja perfume and you want to pay about $100, $115, go get yourself this fragrance right here. You won't be, I'll tell you what. You, if you don't like this, you will be able to sell this bottle within 15 minutes online. So that's the type of fragrance this is. Perfect, beautiful. All the essences are perfect. The blend is perfect. Just go ahead and get your nose on it. Roger Dove himself put it on this thing. And I only mention that because we all want to see what his blending prowess is like. And this is a fragrance you can get with his step of approval on it for under $120. A great fragrance for daily wear. A great fragrance for anyone to fall in love with. That centerfold rose or rose centerfolio. The geranium, the oak moss, the woods, the lavenders, the herbaceous parts, the rosy parts, the floral parts, the spicy parts, all this fragrance can handle is what about you wanting to present to someone. You can kill the fragrance with anyone and they will enjoy it. I can't say enough. Ladies and gentlemen, that is my experience with you guys today. I gave you the volume two of the blend series, the business, leisure, elegant evening, nightlife, and daily fragrance for you guys to consume put into your collection and have wonderful fragrance experiences with. I hope, like I said, that you guys enjoyed this particular experience. I love bringing it to you. If you found anything of entertaining or educational value about this particular video, all I ask is that you hit the like button. If you have any questions or concerns, I love getting back with you guys and answering those questions and concerns. And like I said, hit the subscribe button. We have more videos to come. I got a great, great video coming up for you next that is a con connoisseur's conversation about a fragrance that I bet many of you don't know about, but it is a lady killer. So look around for that video to come next. And until next time, you guys have a beautiful week, wonderful day, and I'll see you then.